Hi, this is Valerie from Valerie's Photo Channel with a quick tip on how to straighten an image in Lightroom. I make regular tutorials, so if you want to get them all, just subscribe to my channel by clicking up here. And if you want my free Digital Photography Basics eBook, you can get it by clicking down here. Now on to the tutorial. It's common when taking a photo with a strong horizon line to end up with an obviously crooked image if you weren't holding the camera perfectly level. But Lightroom offers several fast and easy ways to fix this. I picked this image because it has a strong horizontal and a strong vertical and you can see that the lifeguard tower is leaning towards the left and the horizon is crooked. So one way of fixing this is to use a tool, the straighten tool, under the crop overlay. Crop overlay is here in the upper left in the develop module and you can also get to it by hitting R on your keyboard. And then we're going to use the straighten tool which looks like a little ruler. So I'm just clicking on that and then I'm going to position it to the left, on the left side of the image at the horizon and then just drag across what I want to be straightened and then let go. And then you can see that Lightroom automatically corrected that. Um, that's corrected both horizontally and this looks vertically much better. So I'm going to reset that by just clicking the reset button and then I just want to show you that you can do the same thing vertically. So I've got my straightening tool and I'm going to click here on the building and then just drag down and this is something I want to be straight and when I let go then you can see that that's straightened as well. And I'll reset that again. And other ways you can use this tool, you can just grab one of these handles in the corner and then you can manually rotate the image. Though of course it's a little harder to be precise, but sometimes you might want your image angled in a certain way. Or you can just simply put your cursor into this box here and you can manually type a value in. So I'm just going to click on reset and close that out. And then I want to show you another way. Um, new in Lightroom 5, if you have Lightroom 5 or higher, there's a new tool under lens corrections called Upright. And Upright is a really great feature. You can use Upright to straighten a horizon with one click or correct perspective and distortion. And it's especially handy if you're photographing buildings and they look like they're leaning in your image. So first I'm going to enable profile corrections. Um, and then I can try out these various options here. And sometimes it takes a little bit of trial and error depending on your image to uh, determine which will give the, the best effect or the best correction. This one is pretty simple. Um, let's take a look at what these do first of all. So auto gives you vertical and horizontal perspective corrections and level will correct the horizon and vertical will give you vertical correction and full will give you horizontal and vertical perspective corrections and it's also the best one if you have extreme distortion say you have buildings that seem to be going at all sorts of weird angles and lots of columns and that sort of thing so let's start off by trying level and that corrects this image nicely. You can see with one click we have a level horizon and this building now looks straight. So I'm just going to, um, let's click off to reset that and then let's try auto. And auto also provides nice a level horizon and a level building but this you can see the these white areas are something that we would need to crop out so to fix that just click the box next to constrain crop and then Lightroom will apply a crop to it and if you don't like that crop you can always go back to the crop overlay tool and then you can adjust it anywhere as you wish 
So those are the basics of straightening your image using both the straighten tool and the new upright tool. I hope you found these tips helpful. If you did, I'd appreciate it if you would hit the like button. And if you want to watch my other Lightroom tutorials, just click up here on top to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.